Bethlehem Academy in the red, the black numerals, white trim, and of course United Christian, the Thunder, are in white. Purple and black, tap controlled by UCA. They're going left to right on your video screen. Cardinals, of course, right to left. Pass across this oh, nice flash to the basket. High off window, no good. Rebound Dillon, and he's off to the races. Dillon going coast to coast and scoring. Senior Hudson Dillon makes it 2 nothing Cardinals right out of the gate. Here's a triple. It's good. Kerr hit the triple. He's a freshman. Dillon out front. Huerta loses his defender, puts it up too strong. Rebound tipped around, taken down by the Thunder. Is coming out of there with it is Sam Rich. Rich, nobody guards him. The three is good. So two triples out of the gate for the Thunder. Showing a little lightning too there. As Dillon brings the ball up. Lost the dribble for an instant. We get a back out front. Huerta. Huerta dribbles. Boy, there's a lot of contact there as he's sandwiched between two players. The three is no good, not even close. And United Christian will come back the other way with Mr. Rich. He already has a triple. Here's another one from three, no good. Boy, the ladies shot a lot of threes for United Christian the other night, too. 6-2, 16-18 to go, and a foul is going to be called on Josiah Henley, son of the head coach, who is Matt Henley. Dylan will inbound it right in front of us, gets it to Huerta. Back out front to Dylan. Ball is deflected, Huerta. Looks to dribble, penetrate, shot from a step back is good. It's a two, so it's six four. As United Christian down the lane, layup is good. Eight four. Dylan has Henley on him. High screen there from where to pass it on the left wing. They get it down on the block. Trying to put it up and having it blocked that time was Lanners. In the Thunder, doubled him on the scoreboard here, 8 4 early. Another attack shot. They're going to have an offensive foul. <laughs> the official didn't remember the number. <laughs> Wish that would have happened to me when I was a kid. <laughs> a four. That's where the brings the ball up. Shots up, no good. Rebound Kerr. He gets an attack mode, pass the left side right under the basket, scores. Ashton Friends hit that one, he's a junior. He's Dylan at that first basket and since then this is his second shot it's no good no good as he'll grab the long rebound wanted to get in the dribble penetration did lost the ball Huerta has it in the corner gets a screen from Dillon and missed about five footer they have no need for a shot clock in this game Henley goes coast to coast 12-4, got to stop the dribbler. As Dillon is getting attack mode, gets under the basket and he scores. 12-6, United Christian. Bringing the ball up is Ezra Webster, a freshman. 
Roberts and a couple freshmen starting. Henley, a sophomore, will pass it to Rich for three, and it's good. The second triple, he's got eight points already. It's 15 6. He's outscored the Cardinals. Dylan across the Cardinal logo. Get, uses that high screen, comes up air, pass comes saved in to Dylan off glass, missed. Rebound taken out by Rich. Rich passes it on the right wing. The freshman Webster backs up with a dribble to improve the spacing, and the ball stolen away by Huerta. Huerta's going back in, layup is too strong. Rebound taken out by Kerr. He'll come back the other way, a little stutter step move, jump stop, missed. Rebound put back up, it's no good. Rebound again by United Christian. Rich three is no good, and another rebound for the Thunder. Here comes another three, and it's no good. They almost got that rebound as Huerta ends up with it. Nine-point deficit, 12.39 to go. Dylan up front to Potter, bounces it on the block. Now they get it back out top of the key. Cardinals taking their time here. Shot clock under 10 seconds. Lob pass on the block, going up where it scores. Right under the basket. He's got four, and it's 15 to eight, but the Cardinals want to D it up here. Webster stops, shots up under the basket, about a three-footer there. For Trends, the junior. It's 17-8. Their shooting percentage has got to be lights out. Here's a three, and it's no good. Dottowich took that. Rebound taken down in the corner. Saved by the Cardinals to Dillon. Dillon in attack mode goes up and scores. Nice job, Austin. He's got six of his team's ten points. Webster brings the ball up. <laughs> Willie Potter gets called for a foul. Cardinals. The shot from three, no good again. Rebound, well, I thought he was out of bounds. Here's a long shot, no good. Rebound tipped around, tipped around, tipped around. And Dylan gets the ball. He looks to dribble, penetrate, and Webster did not agree with the call. It's called for the foul. Full court pressure is going to be put on here by UCA, and I don't think I'd be uh, full court pressuring Mr. Dillon. He's got a very fast dribble. Dillon ends up saving the day on that one as he dribbles to his left. Looks to attack, they switch on him. Bounce pass goes into Huerta, through the lane, shots up, no good. Rebound taken down, Huerta taps it out. Dylan has it for three, and it's bottom of the net. He's got nine of his team's 13 points. It's he and Huerta that have scored. Again, they get in attack mode here. Potter's going to check back in, Willie the senior. And sitting down will be Zach Lanners, the junior. Here's another three. It's almost an air ball. Just barely grazed iron. Huerta got the rebound over to Dillon. And again, they're going to try and pressure Dillon. Stutter step move as he's making his way to the basket. Goes up, the shot block. Coming back the other way is United Christian. Shots up from 10. It's no good. Rebound back up off glass, and it's good. And the Cardinals need to box out here. Kerr scored. 
Boy, that last trip for Dillon looked like he might have been fouled from the front. The block from behind was pretty clean. As he gets the ball and looks to get in attack mode again. Passes it to Huerta. Huerta, long range jumper, swish. Coach Dillon, Coach uh, Friesen's going to take a timeout, and we've got a four point game here thanks to United Christian getting a little cold. 9.31 to go, first half, 1915. United Christian leads the Cardinals at Bethlehem Academy as Dotter Witch shoots a three, it's no good. Rebound, and the three, and it's no good. And boy, there was somebody on the back there, but. United Christian's going to come back the other way. Rich has it. Passes it. They get it to Webster for three. It's bottom of the net. They have four threes here in the first half, and it's 22-15. Dylan going right side of the hoop, bounce all the way through. Dodderwich for three, no good. Rebound taken down. And we have a foul on the rebound. Gonna be on trends. Lanners is gonna check back in. Dodderwich is gonna sit down for the Cardinals. Also in the game for BA is Hayden Dillon, the freshman. He's number four. Makes a nice over-the-shoulder catch. Well, he almost went over back, and we're going to have a turnover. Yeah. Went right to the basket and stuffed it to Josiah Henley. 24-15, just when they got it down to four. Muerta, free throw line, gets shut off. As Dillon throws it on the right side to Dillon. Got to keep my Dillon straight. Here's a long range jumper, no good. and. Back up to nine, could go to double digits here. Shots up off glass, and Kerr scores. He's got seven. They've got great balance. And the Cardinals have relied on two guys for their offense here. Huerta gets the ball. Now back out to Dillon. It's 26-15. Dillon in the lane, goes up, and the foul will be called. <laughs> Trends is second foul. And Hudson Dillon misses the first free throw. And the second one. Well, UCA has pretty much dominated glass, too. Dylan almost got a steal there as he was trying to get the ball inside. So inbounding the ball will be the freshman Webster. Bounces it to Henley. The ball's knocked out of bounds off of United Christian. Smart play by the young Dylan, Aiden. Bill Hudson will bring the ball up, walks it across midcourt. In the shot clock is 35 seconds in both boys and girls high school basketball this year. Huerta through the lane, goes up a shot, no good. <laughs> I think you heard Coach Friesen. He thought there should have been a foul call. My fault, sorry. So Webster will come out for a few minutes here and Rich checks back in. Kerr will sit down. 
As Henley throws it all the way down on the left side. Henley under the basket tried to get the ball and it's Cardinal ball. It's going to be a turnover here. Twenty-six fifteen. It was nineteen fifteen just a few minutes ago. They haven't scored since that timeout at the Cardinals when they had it down to four. Let's go, down loose. Aaron three. spectator. No, oh, you missed the reverse layup. Shots up. It's oh, it's in and out. Back in again by Potter. Well, they do get a third person in the scoring column. 26-17 is Henley. We're to bodying them up. They get it in the right corner. A couple of left-handed dribbles to Jeremiah McDougal, a junior. McDougal, again, will be fouled, they say. Red 14. It's going to be on Lanners. His first. So Joe Rich comes out. Sam Rich inbounds the ball. Lobs it way out front to Henley. Josiah looks to dribble penetrate. Goes up and scores. Little flip shot. He's got six. As Dillon again goes right, misses, rebound taken down by Rich. He'll pass it in the corner, get an open three, and it's no good. Rebound taken out by Dillon. Let's see if he can get in attack mode and beat everybody down the floor. As he gets it to Huerta, Huerta thought about a three, looks to dribble penetrate, they collapse on him, shots up, no good. Rebound, saved in bounds. Oh, no. Dylan to Huerta, and it's good. The long two. He's got eight. It's 28-19. Webster back in the game for United Christian. He'll shoot the three, it's bottom of the net. Gotta get a hand in the shooter's face. These guys can shoot if you leave them open. Huerta. Yeah. Dillon. Younger Dillon back to Hudson. Lanners will pass it right side to Hayden Dillon. Back to Hudson. Three by Hudson's no good. Rebound take it down. And again they're in tack mode. Shots up, it's partially blocked. Huerta gets it ahead to Dillon. Dillon goes in, layup, and now is that not a foul? Oh my word. There's clearly contact on the layup. Here comes a three, and it's good. That's quite a turn of events. No foul called on the layup when there was clearly body contact. They go down and get a three. It's 34 19. Wow. Dillon shot, no good. Rebound taken down by Hendley. Throws it all the way down the floor. And we're going to have a foul called as Kerr is going to go to the free throw line. It's going to be on Hudson Dillon. Two shots for number two. He throws good by curve. He made a boat. We got some good shooters on this team, 36-19. All right. 
Hudson. Hudson goes to the left side. He's been primarily driving right. Dodderwich gets it to Lanners. Now to Dillon. Hudson. Lobs it back out. Here's a three. It is rims off. Coming flying in. Kerr gets a rebound. There was no Cardinal really that grabbed that or tried to grab it. Webster. Sit out front. Step back Rich, back to Webster, who's already hit a couple threes. Rich has as well. Back to Webster. The freshman goes up and an offensive foul on the freshman. His second. Hopefully he's okay. He's slow to get up here. And they're going to take out Mr. Webster, make sure he's okay here, and bring in Jeremiah McDougal, the junior. Again, full court pressure put on here by UCA. They're up 36-19 as Huerta brings the ball up. Stops. Nobody uh, really inside there. Gets it over to Dillon. Left side. Scores. He's got 11 points and four layups among the 11 points. Shots up by Henley, no good. Rebound Huerta. And the Cardinals down by 15 with 2.29 to go. Would like to get this to single digits. Pass goes in the corner. Dillon out front to Hudson. Dillon by Hayden. Back to Hudson. There's Dillon. Don't stand. Don't Passes it in the corner. Back to Dillon. Five, four, three. There's two seconds on the shot clock, and he had to kind of force himself into a difficult shot. Let's go, let's go, boys. It's 36-21. Here's a three, and it's no good. Rebound put back up off glass. He was not boxed out, and Rich gets the easy bunny. He's got 10. Boy, do they have great balance. My, oh, my. As Huerta brings the ball up. He'll shoot. It's no good. Rebound yanked, and I mean yanked down by McDougal. McDougal, great pass. He got too far underneath. Might have been pushed, but they didn't call it that foul, I don't think. Webster's back. That's good to see. <laughs> Minute 21 to go in the half. A single digit halftime deficit might be asking a little too much at this point, but about 12 points would be nice. <laughs> They're being patient here. They say the ball's going to go to United Christian. Mike, there, you know. And this team does not know clock. <laughs> Don't need a shot clock with these boys. Webster. They'll pass it on the left wing. Pass across court. The steal by Dillon. Two guys in front of him, and one of them steals the ball. Yep, keep her, keep her. Kerr scores, and a blocking foul's called on Huerta. Basket's good by number two. So he missed the free throw. 14 for that young man. Webster throws up kind of a prayer. The ball, I thought, went behind the backboard, but... Dillon will inbound it. They'll back off the full court pressure with 25 seconds to go up by 19. Dillon, 
20 seconds. I think I'd have gone for the last shot. That way they can't score. Here's a shot by Huerta, no good. There's 13 seconds, and we're going to have a foul go the other way. His second foul on uh, Hudson Dillon. Eleven seconds to go. Webster. Looks like they might go for the last shot. Well, there's a three by Rich. Bang! Again, uncontested. That's halftime in the auditorium. Seven threes in the first half by United Christian and a 43-21 lead. Well, let's get this second half underway. With the score 43-21, United Christian. Cardinals are gonna have to get some stops and some hoops. Hudson Dillon dribbles to his right. Starters are back on the floor. Huerta, Dillon, Potter, Dodderwich, Lanners. Lanners has it, turnaround jumper, no good. Tried to tap it back up, no good. And here comes Keller. Or Kerr, excuse me, now Webster, top of the key. Webster, the sophomore, on the floor along with Trends. There's Webster for three. It's no good. I thought he might have traveled. Rebound taken out by Huerta. They let a lot of shuffling of the feet go on these days. Huerta. Yeah. Manners was posted up. Dylan goes left. He'll stop, pop, miss. Rebound taken out on the weak side by Kerr. He's only a freshman. Layup good. Just took it right to the rack. He's got 16. Change of speed. Huerta in the corner. Lanners gets it on the block. Turn around. Is shut off. Turns the other way. Gets it to Huerta. Dribbles to his right. Get back out front to Potter. Brings it over to Dill. Dillon misses a shot in the paint. Rebound Potter, scoops it back to Lanners. He'll take the three, and it's almost a banker. Rebound taken down by Webster. Webster goes coast to coast. The shot blocked by Huerta. And we're going to have a foul, I think, or did he step out of bounds? He stepped out of bounds. Forty-five, twenty-one. Hudson Dillon looking to get closer to the hoop. Goes up as the ball is knocked away. There have not been a lot of turnovers in this game. Webster is going to the basket. Rich has it. Cardinals trying to D it up a little better here. They're going to open look by Webster. Bang! Again, a wide open look, his third triple. Eight threes for United Christian. And then there's going to be an over and back here. Forty-eight twenty-one. So Braylon Kerr, a freshman who has 16 points to lead all scorers, tosses it into Josiah Henley, the sophomore. Goes up, scores. He's got eight. Potter, right side isolation goes. It's blocked and a foul by the body. We got him with a body. Not much question about that one. Be his third. His trends. So Potter's at the free throw line and misses the free throws. 
Cardinals are 0 for 3 from the free throw line. Swish it. One for four are the Cardinals, two for three are the Thunder. Webster again. It's a long triple, no good. Rebound Hudson Dillon. Brings it up the far sideline. Left to right. Stops, shoots, misses. <laughs> Rebound, outlet now. Kerr. It was a nice board by Trins. Webster comes up, they get him the ball. Another open look in the corner is good. Nine triples. It's 53-22. Dillon passes to Potter. They get on the block to where it's knocked away. Gets it back. But the throw is too far for Potter to get it. Cardinals already have as many turnovers here in the first few minutes of this half as they had the entire first half. As checking in for Bethlehem Academy is Lucas Karen. He's a sophomore. Number 21 goes in for Potter. Fifty-three twenty-two. The freshman Webster stops free throw line shot. Good. He's got eleven. As Dylan missed the layup. It's 55-22. Kerr lobs it in on the block. Fakes one way, goes the other. Misses, rebound taken down by Dodowich. Huerta on the left side of the basket. Reverse dribble off glass scores. Nice move. He's got 10. But if the Cardinals are going to come back at this, they got to get some stops. Kerr goes in the lane, shoots the shot, and we're going to have a foul. Yeah, Dodderwich. His first. Braylon Kerr, freshman at the line. Got 19, missed the free throw. He's two for four. He's the only guy who shot free throws for the Thunder. Oh, really? Made the second one, they're gonna call foul, I think, on Karen. Lucas, Lucas, 21. Lucas, 21. Here's a three that's no good. Let's go, let's go. Joe Rich missed that one. He looked at his hand after he missed it. Going in, Dylan gets fouled by Rich. Free throws no good. And so's the second one. And they are owning the glass too, is coming up the floor. Trying to take it all the way to the hoop. That time was trends. Yeah. 
So Webster will inbound it. Grab it, grab it, grab it. Oh my, he threw it right in the hands of the Donowich, but he wasn't expecting it, and who would? Go yeah. so Webster. Was left. He lost the dribble, and they're going to call another foul. And this one's on United Christian. If it's on trends, it's his fourth, and it is. So their top rebounder sits down. Can you recover from 32 points in 12 minutes? We'll find out, I guess. And pass deflected, another turnover. And Lee will throw it across court. And <laughs> Webster. Here's a three, and it's no good. Rebound taken down. Coming out of there with it, Dodderwich. Brings it across midcourt. Left-handed dribble. Goes to the basket, scoops it up, and he's fouled. Coast to coast. Point one. Two shots. Ball's on Joe Rich. Coast to coast used to be a hardware store. <laughs> Swish on the free throw. One for six prior to that were the Cardinals from the line. Rips the nylon. For his first couple points, the freshman. And a freshman brings the ball up for United Christian. Stops at the free throw line. It goes back and gets an easy layup. He's got 13. Dylan. There's some contact. Again, no foul call, but he does end up with a basket. They're letting him play out here. We haven't seen a ton of free throws. Henley looks to dribble penetrate. Get it back out front. Webster in the lane. In the lane, shots up from three, and it's good by Kerr. He's got 23 points. He's got nine this half, had 14 in the first half. He's got 23 points. Ball's knocked out of bounds. That young man could shoot. But again, they have not had a lot of hands in the face. Here's an open three that's no good by Hayden Dillon. Webster to, to Henley. It's 61-28. Here's Webster's three, and it's bottom of the net. Man, oh man. That is his fourth triple of this game. He's got 16 points. Dylan scores. He's got 15. And Webster will come back again. Here's another three from the corner. It's short. Rebound taken down by Karen. It's a Dylan. Whoops, he looked to pass it to uh, Hayden Dillon, I think, where it kind of got in the middle of that, and it ends up in a turnover. That's their 11th turnover of the game. Coach Henley's going to get some subs in here with 9.24 to go, and his team up 64 to 30. Thomas Serafin, a seventh grader in the game. As Rich brings the ball up. Here's a three. Bang! Henley gets his first triple of the game. They've got double digit triples. Oh, yeah. 
Dillon goes over the basket, misses the layup, coming back the other way. Here it is, layup good. United Christians, Jeremiah McDougall gets the layup. 69 to 30. Dillon. I gotta set it down. Get it into Huerta. Huerta jump shot, no good. Rebound taken down by United Christian. Pass goes in the corner, driving baseline. He lets Dylan go over him. And getting the uh, layup is. Sam Rich, and he'll also get free throw here as Dylan gets called for the foul. His third. Running time? Yeah, I had to run. Yeah, I'm sorry, I stopped. So Sam Rich at the free throw line here to shoot one. That's why I set it down. We are at running time. <laughs> Made the free throw. Well, yeah, I think I read some stuff on United Christians' website where they're from 28 different cities. So they truly are an all-star Metro team. 28 different cities represented, not uh, in the team, but in the school. Here's a three that's no good. Joe Rich wants to come back the other way. Here's a three. It's no good. Rebound taken down by Potter. Thomas Serafin wanted to get in the three-point shooting parade. Potter's out front. Pass goes underneath to Huerta. Huerta shoots and misses. Rebound taken down by Hendley. Shots up, no good. Rebound, Huerta, and he had a young man on his back. McDougal. So Webster comes back. Trends comes back with his four fouls. With 6.23, running time 72.30. Huerta uh, misses everything. The Thunder's talents have clearly been on display here. Dylan's going to shoot a three, and it's good. His second, and uh, he's got the only two threes that Bethlehem Academy has. Here's another one by them. It's no good. United Christian shooting threes all over the place. We had a tie-up call. Possession arrow stays with the Thunder. Webster will inbound it. The freshman. Sander will be right in the corner. They lob it in to Krenz, bounces it out front. Kerr, bounce pass to Webster out front. Good talk. Freshman gets it in the corner for another long range jumper. It's another three. This one by Weston Trends, a junior. Man, oh man, can they shoot. Here's a three, it's no good by Dillon. Rebound taken down by Kerr. He'll go up, shots up, no good. Rebound taken down by Huerta. And he has the ball knocked away from behind. As the clock continues to tick tock. Last year's game. Potter has it out front in the game is uh, 
Brecken Catterlick, a sophomore. Here's a free left side, no good. Rebound Krenz again. He's got to have double digit boards. As he comes up, goes right to the basket and scores. to position himself like he was going to take a charge, but he was too far underneath. There's a triple. It's no good. Rebound Potter. It's yeah. good. Yeah. He's got five points. Nice job, bro. Let's go. There's Webster. Trends went up. We're going to have a fall on work, though. Caden Dockerstool, a freshman, getting ready to check in for the Cardinals. Wirt is going to have a seat. Or no, I, I guess he's getting a water. So they're going to bring Rich back in the game. They're going to bring Henley back in the game. Xander Smith was in there, the junior, for a while. <laughs> Free throws are no good. Here's a three, it's no good. Shot was taken by Dockerstool. Friends. Here's a steal by Dillon. He'll go in, and there'll be a reach in on Rich. Sam Rich. That's his second. Here's a three left side, no good. Rebound taken down, put back up, and it is no good. Rebound's taken down by Joe Rich, the senior. Stops, pops, and scores. That was a nice move by Thomas Serafin, the seventh grader. He stopped, lost the defender completely, and made the hoop. Here's a Wert, a long-range jumper. It's no good. Dylan back up, no good. Battling on the glass. Good job by Catterlick there. We got wholesale substitutions coming in here for the Cardinals. There's a minute 15. Three's no good. Well, UCA's shooting percentage has to be lights out here. Inside the free throw line, as I say that, one's bricked. And there's a three, no good. Lanners gets the ball. 42 seconds to go. He throws it right into the hands of Henley. The layup is no good. Ball rolls out of bounds. I remember the clock continues to tick while it's rolling. Seventeen seconds to go. Pass comes in to Dodderwich. Seven seconds to go. Dodderwich takes the three. It's in and out. No good. Rebound taken down by Henley, and that's the game. 79-35 United Christian. Man, can this team shoot the end of the game with Let's see here, they had seven threes in the first half. They had one, two, three, four, five, six in the second half. 13 total threes in the game. Cardinals had just two threes, both by Hudson Dillon. He finished the game with 18 points. And Aaron Huerta had 10, the only two guys in double figures for the Cardinals. In your final, 79-35, Thunder.